When using WPS Presentation, we sometimes add a header and or a footer to make the slides look more professional. How can we realize it? In this example, get into the Insert tab and click the Header and Footer button. Then we will see the two tabs of Slide and the Notes and Handout in the Header Footer dialog. Let's talk about the Slide tab first. Here we can insert the date and time, footer, and page number in the footer, which are respectively positioned in the bottom left, middle, and right areas of the slide. If we want to add date and time information, check the date and time option. WPS Office also provides default date formats. For more customized settings, get into the Fixed tab. If we want to add certain text as a footer, click the Footer button and enter the corresponding contents in the input box. If we want to insert page numbers for slides, check the slide number option. Then WPS Presentation will number the slide pages automatically. After finishing all the settings, we can apply the settings to the corresponding slides in terms of actual demands. To keep the existing settings in all slides, click Apply to All. If we only need to apply the setting to the current slide, click Apply. In the coming section, you will listen to the introduction to the Notes and Handouts tab. Different from the settings enabled in the Slide tab, it needs users to get into the View tab and click the Notes page button to see the preview effect of the slides with the header and footer. Here we can see four factors enabled to be inserted in the slides including date and time, header, page number, and footer. Date and time and header will be inserted at the upper right and the upper left corner of the slide by default, while page number and footer are respectively added at the bottom right and bottom left corner. Click Apply to All to finish all settings. Here is the final effect of the slide inserted in the header and footer.